My name is Richard Pease. I'm from Odessa, Texas, Terminal 57. Uh, I just came back to American Eagle. I was here whenever American Eagle started for two years and uh, thought I wanted my own authority, so I ventured out and did that. And it's taken me several years to get back, but I'm back where I belong. What made you want to go on your own, and what made you want to come back? Talk about it. Just the idea of having my own, doing my own thing, and uh, it didn't work out too good when the oil field crashed, and uh, I decided to let my numbers go back. And uh, I went to heavy hauling, doing specialized, and did some coil tubing, and uh, just finally had enough. And my girlfriend had a truck, and we looked at each other one day and said, "Why not?" So I told her, I said, "I think we need to go to American Eagle." Uh, Miss Pat takes good care of her drivers, and, and uh, it's just, it's like being back home. So what is the difference? I mean, do you get a lot more support when you're leased on and you don't have to deal with all the headaches? Talk about that a little bit. I ain't got to sit down every month and, you know, figure out who owes what, sit down and try to drive the truck, work on the truck, do the invoicing, go out and make sales calls. They call me, we load the wagon, we go to work. They've got somebody else, they pay good money to do the rest of it. The truck actually belongs to her, I'm just the driver. I do all the grunt work and she makes the money. So she's managing uh, the books back home and you're out on the road, is that it? Yeah. Yeah, she rides with me, you know, most of the time. So tell me, what, what did you guys move today? We moved some uh, V-bottom cutting tanks and some shell shakers. Picked them up in Dilly, Texas and then brought them out here to Monahan's, dropped them off. What kind of uh, truck and trailer do you have? It's a 2001 379. It's got a yellow nightmare under the hood. And then uh, we pulled a 48 102 spread axle, all aluminum turner, flatbed. What, uh, what kind of area do you typically run? I've covered all 48. I just made a run up to Montana to the Canadian border and dropped off a load and came back. And, and uh, just about got them all covered. Stretching your legs a little bit? Yeah, yeah. It's nice every once in a while, but it's also nice to be home, you know, most nights. Did you grow up out here in Odessa? Born and raised. Really? Yeah. Tell me about life in Odessa. The people are good, you know. Uh, it's just like living anywhere else. It has its pros and cons. Tell me what you'd tell other guys out on the road about American Eagle and the Bennett family. Come over and give it a try. You know, uh, don't just come over and stay for a couple of weeks, decide, you know, it's not for you, give it a chance. You know, it's starting out hard. Starting out is very hard. But once you get started and you get things turned to the right, then you make a lot of money over here.